Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving deep into the PPI mechanism of action. Our focus will be on uncovering exactly how proton pump inhibitors, or PPIs, tackle one of our body's most common yet complex processes, the secretion of gastric acid. Let's start with the basics. It's always good to have a solid foundation before diving into the more intricate details. Normally your stomach produces gastric acid, primarily hydrochloric acid, which is crucial for digestion. This acid helps break down the food you eat, making it easier for your body to absorb nutrients. This acid is produced by cells in the stomach lining known as parietal cells. These cells are specialized for this purpose and play a key role in maintaining the acidic environment of the stomach. These cells have a special enzyme called hydrogen potassium adenosine triphosphatase, or as it's commonly known, the gastric proton pump. This enzyme is essential for the acid production process. This enzyme is the real hero when it comes to secreting acid, as it exchanges hydrogen ions into the stomach in return for potassium ions right across the stomach cell membrane. This exchange is a critical step in the production of gastric acid. Now, here's where PPIs come into play. These medications are designed to intervene in this process. Let's explain proton pump inhibitors mechanism of action in more details. PPIs are a group of potent inhibitors that specifically target and block the hydrogen potassium adenosine triphosphatase enzyme system. By doing so, they effectively halt the production of gastric acid at its source. Proton pump inhibitors are prodrugs that require activation in an acid environment. After absorption into the systemic circulation, the prodrug diffuses into the parietal cells of the stomach and accumulates in the acidic secretory canaliculi. Here it is activated to sulfonamide. The activated form then binds covalently with sulfhydryl groups of cysteines in the hydrogen potassium adenosine triphosphatase, irreversibly inactivating the pump molecule. Acid secretion resumes only after new pump molecules are synthesized and inserted into the luminal membrane. By doing this, they prevent the final step in acid production, effectively reducing the overall secretion of gastric acid. This reduction can provide significant relief for individuals suffering from acid-related conditions. This mechanism makes proton pump inhibitors highly effective for treating conditions like gastroesophageal reflux disease, peptic ulcers, and other acid-related disorders. These conditions can be quite debilitating, and PPIs offer a reliable solution. I hope you learned the mechanism of action of proton pump inhibitors. Don't forget to subscribe for more insightful dives into medication's mechanism of action. Your support helps us continue to bring you valuable content. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.